This is Paul Autry's car after a drunk driver smashed into it, instantly killing his wife just three days before their 10th wedding anniversary. We were yard sailing. And as a matter of fact, there's a Circle K right there. We were supposed to go into that gas station, get something to drink. And that's when he come up across the double yellow line, hit us head on. And here on Washington Road in November of 2010 is where the drunk driver came around 70 miles per hour, crashing into Paul's vehicle, forever changing his and his family's life. Left now only with the memory of his wife. Emotionally, Paul says he will never be the same. He was also hurt physically in the accident. Here I am, sitting in a wheelchair, got to have more surgery, and it's been almost two years. I still got to have another operation, all because one man wanted to drink. What keeps Paul going is his two daughters. Hopefully, we'll be getting together soon. Mm -hmm. um, but as it stands right now, they're out doing their own things and trying to live their life the best they can. Um, and I'm proud of them. Daniel Morales is the man who is driving the car that changed Autry's life. He is serving a 15-year sentence in prison. And it's my goal to make sure he serves every second of that 15 years. I will be at every parole hearing, even if one day I meet someone different, someone special. Autry hopes his loss could save another life. He encourages drivers to think before they get behind the wheel. In Augusta, Courtney Elledge, WJBF News Channel 6.